Shocking testimony in a Hamilton County courtroom today as convicted serial killer Anthony Kirkland confessed to four murders. The admissions came the seventh day of his resentencing hearing. Nine on your sides, Tom McKee was there for all of it. He choked three of his victims and stabbed a fourth. That's what Anthony Kirkland told a Hamilton County jury here on Monday. He said in the confessions in each particular case, he got angry and then simply lost control. The prosecution wants jurors to sentence Anthony Kirkland to death. In his more than eight hour statement, Kirkland first admitted murdering 13 year old Esme Kenny by strangulation. How did she die? Come on, you're there. Because of what? Cassandra Crawford snuck out of her grandparents' house in June of 2006, ran into Kirkland, but rejected his offers of sex for money. She needs She needs you. In the case of Mary Jo Newton, Kirkland said they were in a van in Eden Park, argued, and he choked her. She turned up and she looked up at me. She told me that uh, the way things were. As Detective Bill Hilbert finished questions on those three cases, Kirkland admitting he had one more victim, Kimya Rollison. She had a paring knife in her hand when they argued in his van, and she was stabbed in the neck. On the right side or in the juggler? Just a lucky shot, or do you know what you're doing? No, it was just a lucky shot. The bodies were burned in all four cases. Kirkland's explanation was that it purified them. All that's left for the prosecution's case is testimony from employees of the Hamilton County Coroner's Office. Then it's up to the fence to try to prove that Kirkland should get life in prison without the possibility of parole. Tom McKee, not on your side at the Hamilton County Courthouse.